Good morning. I just wanted to take a minute to show you how to make someone else a co-host on your Zoom meeting, particularly if you're going to be absent. So this will allow you to make another teacher the co-host so that they can open your meeting and teach your students or at least direct your students to where they're supposed to go. So you're going to start at the Dearborn Schools website. You're going to go to the staff portal. And accept that you have to click right. Dang it, let's try again. You're going, to, I clicked twice apparently, but we're go, not going to click on any of those ones at the top. We're going to go down here. We're going to open Zoom. We're going to say sign in. Now, depending on what computer you're on and what, whether you've already signed in, it might ask you to sign in again with your Google account, which is normal, and you should just do that. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to look at meetings. Because hopefully you have made your reoccurring meeting with no fixed time like we talked about. So you have a meeting that's your meeting where your kids go every day when you meet them. So you're going to open that meeting and you're going to say edit. And you might want to edit all occurrences because then that person will be ready anytime that you happen to be absent. And I don't have mine fixed properly. I should fix mine while I'm in here and make it no fixed time. And give myself a better password because I won't remember that. And then this is the important part. You don't want to authenticate also, but any of those other things are your choice. What we're looking at today is this thing that says alternative hosts. So let's just say I want to make Ms. Maksud my alternative host in case I cannot go there. Yeah. yeah. So I'm going to put her email in there. And I'm going to save it. And now, if I am absent, she, I could send her the link. I, obviously, if you did this for someone, you would share your link with them so that they would know where to go. And then they would be able to open your meeting and talk to your students and teach them that day or at least send them where they needed to go. So that would be a very helpful thing for you to plan ahead of time so that if you do happen to be absent, we won't be scrambling at the last minute. So that would be my suggestion. 